Any luck? No sign of them anywhere. Well, they couldn't have gotten off the hospital grounds without someone noticing Teresa's in a wheelchair. Look, I doubt it. I just pray that we find them before... Before Gwen does something else that she'll regret. Well, she's already tried to kill Teresa once. I mean, who's to say she won't try to do it again? Where did Rebecca and Ethan go? Maybe they went back in here. Oh, that's strange. I assume that door was locked. It usually is since they started working down here. She has to pay! She's not, not this way. That is the only way Ethan Shore to kill Sarah. She took our baby, now she's trying to steal you! Listen to me, I'm not going anywhere. You're not losing me to anyone, you hear me? She just tried to kill me, Ethan! I don't know what you're doing, okay? Ethan, I know exactly what I am doing. For the first time in my life, I'm going to trust my instincts, and I'm going to break the rules just like you always Honey, do! Honey, you're not thinking straight. You've already been accused once, okay? This is going to make things worse for you. I'm going to see her thrown in jail and put away for the rest of her miserable, psychotic life! Let me go! No, Teresa, the one who deserves to be locked up is you for the way you have treated my daughter. I mean, everybody knows that Gwen is a lovely person inside and out, but you have totally pushed her over the edge. Now, and she has taken it and taken it and taken it more than anyone could ever tolerate. Now, as if that wasn't enough. No, then you had to steal her last chance at being a mother. You just stole it right from under her. And then you had to declare to everybody how the father of your baby was her husband. Rebecca, enough! And as if that wasn't enough. No, no, we all had to hear about how you tricked Ethan into impregnating you because he wouldn't cheat on his beloved wife. Beloved wife? Rebecca? Everyone knows that Ethan and I would have been happily married for years now if it weren't for you and Gwen trying to punish me. Trying to punish my family. You stole my child from right, me. both of you, stop it. Ethan, let me go. Teresa deserves to die. You would just forget Rich. it. Stop it. What's going on here? Oh, my God. I hope I don't have to file new charges against Gwen. Now, what the hell happened? Sam, it's not the way it looks. No, it's much worse. My daughter was really sick tonight, so I had to bring her to the hospital. Jane had a really high fever. Wait a second. Jane? You named my baby Jane? I was waiting to find out how she was doing when Gwen came out of nowhere. She tried to stab you me to death. my baby Jane? We were going to name her Ashley. Teresa, her name is Ashley. You don't have a baby, Gwen. You never had a baby. The only baby is mine and Ethan's. And we named her Jane together. Teresa, no. Don't defend her, Ethan. This woman is going back to jail, and I'm going to see to it that she never walks again. Teresa, have heart here. You see what she's going through. You understand what kind of shape she's in what now. What about me, Ethan? I'm paralyzed. I'm in a wheelchair because of her, and if you hadn't found me just now, I would be dead. Your child wouldn't have a mother. Ethan, what is she talking about? I'll explain it to you later. Ethan, I... I want to see my Ashley. Can you please take me to see Ashley right now? When? You do not have an Ashley, okay? You don't have a baby. Teresa, stop. It's the truth. Teresa. Ethan, where's Ashley? Can you please take me to see her right now? I mean, what did Teresa do with my little girl? There is no Ashley, When? Only Jane. Teresa? Her name is Ashley. My daughter's name is Ashley. Ethan, take me to see Ashley right now. I want to see my Ashley. No. 